Hey everybody, and welcome back to Let's Play Sonic Adventure DX Director's Cut Chow Help Part 37. Here we have our Hero Swim Chow. Well, you know, not fully evolved Hero Swim Chow, but I thought I'd show her off really quick because she should evolve within the next two hours. We have, you know, she's turned green now, and her stomach is green fully instead of yellow, and the little spikes in the back of her head have grown out a little bit, so... I just wanted to show her progress so far, and I'll be back one more time before she evolves to show her, you know, right before she evolves and to see how much more progress she's made. So, I'll be back in a bit. Bye! Hey everybody, and we are back with Marilyn, or Marilyn, Marion. Apparently she's hungry, but as you can see, she started turning a more yellowish green on the back of her spikes, which are now extremely long, and her backside, and her stomach is still, um, the pale green that it was before, as you can see for a little bit in there, but it's turned a little bit more blue instead, and her ball is now, uh, a neonish bright green. So, she's coming along quite nicely, and she's gonna be evolving here in a bit. She might even evolve after this nap, I'm not sure, but, uh, just thought I'd check in again for the second time, and I will see you guys when she evolves. Bye! Hey everybody, and we are back, and Marion is evolving, so now I'm going to unpause it. There she goes! Uh, the only thing that's really different about her, I- is that her- uh, the things coming out of her head, the leaf things, they got a little bit longer and a little bit thicker, but other than that, nothing else has really happened. It's only been about a half an hour since, uh, the last time I recorded, so... It, she didn't wake up right out, or she didn't evolve right after that nap, but... I knew that when I took her out of the water this time, she'd, she'd evolve, because she'd been in the, the water for about, uh, 20... Well, not 20, but 15 minutes, maybe? And so I knew that it was about time, so I knew that when I picked her up and took her out, that she'd evolve. Alright, let's see our first Hero Swim Chow. Come on! There we go! Yay! Alright, so, basically the difference is about this and the pre-evolved Chow is that A, the halo, and the eyes, but then also, oh no, bummer, I had sh stuff to show off with her. But, uh, secondly, you can see the, the, uh, wave, or the, the leaves have a more intricate pattern, and her stomach is now the inverse of what, what it was before. Also, I don't know if you were able to see it for a brief second there, if you rewind, but her, sp her spike now points back into a jet, so it looks more pointed, like, suited for swimming. I need to remove this otter, because it's very irritating. There. Alright. That's all the sounds for now. Oh, see? There you can see now. It's, it's pointed again. I'm gonna literally murder all of these animals. I hate it so much. It's just been, like, constant popping up and down. But whatever. So this has been How to Make a Hero Swim Chow. Tomorrow we will be back with Marion for How to Make a Hero, uh, Hero Swim Swim Chow. So... Thank you all so much for watching. I'm glad she's evolved. Have a great night, and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye!